All right, thanks so much, Heidi. Well, it's Wellness Wednesday, and Dr. Binks is back with us from the Texas Tech Weight Management Clinic. But this time, especially in, in time for Valentine's Day, he's going to be putting on his love hat. So, Dr. Binks, thank you so much for being here. Can I call you Dr. Love? Certainly. <laughs> It's a, it's, a, it's a timely topic, right? Yes. Um, we, we talk about love. What, in terms of the definition of it, what does love mean to you? Oh, putting me on the spot <laughs> there. It means my beloved back in North Carolina, of course. Um, well, I, you know, I, I think it, it's really different for every person. Yeah. Some people look for that security and consistency and safety. Others look for the fireworks mm -hmm. going off. And I think it's most important for people to understand what they need from a partner. Okay, well, we talked earlier in the show about what Valentine's Day means to us, and neither one of us, Heidi nor myself, really celebrates Valentine's Day, but I know a lot of people put a lot of emphasis into this holiday and expect love this holiday. Uh, what does the holiday really have to do with the internal feeling of love? Well, you know, I think it could be that it's just a reminder to really put a, a punctuation mark on, on the fact that you love somebody that's in your life every day and so forth. Some of the more cynical folks call it a more commercialized holiday yeah. and so forth. And you said you don't, uh, hand, my, when I met my, my current uh, girlfriend, I told her I don't do Valentine's Day. So we <laughs> celebrated President's Day with hearts and flowers every year uh, for quite some time in our relationship. So I I really think you know you have love for the person all year round mm -hmm. uh, putting too many demands on it can really cause stress that doesn't need to be there mm -hmm. but do something fun do something nice and what about for the person who doesn't have that significant other in their life um, what do you suggest they do to not necessarily focus so much on the fact that it is Valentine's Day there's so much that leads up to it but they don't have that person to enjoy it with it can be a very difficult time for people if they happen to be alone and I think that oftentimes I hear people talking about getting together. Love is broadly defined. So with other loved ones in your life, mm -hmm. your, your friends, your family, and so forth can really sort of take the pressure off of it and do something nice for another person yeah. can also make you feel like you're giving love. I like that. That's a good point. you got to give love to others around you, whether they're a significant other or not. There's plenty of people in your life to give love to, and hopefully you'll get that in return. Yes. Right? Yeah. Thank you so much for being here. You're awesome. Love talking about love. Um, when people want to get in touch with you, what's the best way for them to contact you? It's the Weight Management Clinic at Nutrition Metabolic Health Initiative, and you can see right there we have uh, www.nmhi.ttu.edu. Uh, Perfect. Thanks, Dr. Binks. Thanks. All right, coming up after the break, we've got Valentine's Day gifts from Dillard's. Stay with us.